Hello and good morning, everyone. It's occurred to me that it's December and therefore that means Vlogmas. And I feel like it would be silly of me not to do it, seeing as pretty much the only thing that I do is vlog. Or it's like the only thing that doesn't feel totally uncomfortable to me. Um, so yeah, it's December 2nd. I, ha I filmed a bunch of stuff for like a Thanksgiving vlog, but I haven't gotten to editing it yet. Ever since I got back, I've been trying to like hit the job hunt pretty hard. Um, so I'm just gonna combine the first two days of Vlogmas and then go from there. Um, yeah, but I didn't film yesterday, but I guess I can fill you in on what I did. As you know, I moved back to Duluth and am unemployed. It's been a minute now. And with a graphic design background and like video editing background, there's not a whole lot of jobs here that particularly, I haven't been seeing any graphic design jobs, sorry. I like woke up, showered, and now I'm here and not feeling the best. Also, I haven't slept like this whole week or been able to eat. And I'm starting to think that those two kind of go together. Um, but so yeah, I've been trying to like w figure out what's my next move type deal. And then I was like, oh shoot, I should like try to get a tattooing apprenticeship. So yesterday, the majority of the day was spent working on like a portfolio to be sending out to these shops. I'll insert the pencil drawing that I added. It took me like eight hours. But then I heard back and then my sister was here and we were like being weird. I'll insert those pictures as well. But then I heard back from this other job that I applied to and I have a design test to do for them. And so that's what I'm gonna try to crank out today. So not like a super fun day by any means, but exciting nonetheless. Those are my eyebrows. Also my birthday is on December 9th, so it's in like a week from today. I'll be turning 27 really awesome to be unemployed and turning 27 and moving have moved back to your hometown that is definitely super cool and fun super stoked on that um so yeah vlogmas while i'm getting ready we can talk about my nails you see these babies? I did these myself. Literally a work of art. This hand, this one fell off, so I'm gonna need to redo that. But also, this week Netflix came out with um, a new docu-series called Bad Surgeon. And of course I had to watch, because I watch all of that shit. Um, and the surgeon was like doing these untested whatever these untested like he was putting plastic windpipes into patients that like needed help with them and had no testing of any kind and then was just literally oh it makes me sick to think about but, so yeah, he was basically conning a lot of people, but, and like he would go fly to Sweden and then perform the surgery and then leave. So, and then none of the surgeries worked. And so obviously he's like a terrible, and then the, the patients died like literally choking on, 
Ugh, plastic, Ugh, it makes me nauseous to think about, wow. Um, but what was interesting to me about that wasn't so much the malpractice. I mean, like it was interesting, but not in, you'll get what I'm about to say. What was interesting was that he was such a con man that he got around like many countries of, like many countries, like I don't, he convinced a bunch of random countries to let him perform these procedures on patients. And I feel like, I don't know, that's like pretty interesting. Like if this guy can fucking, and he was super rich. So it's just making me wonder if someone evil can be rich and like work the system to their benefit. Why can't I? So that's what, that's what that made me think about, but really a terrible story. And I feel like he should be in jail. Um, another great thing that I watched this week was the new Real Housewives of Beverly Hills episode. They were, they all got high at a dinner table and it was like literally the best episode I've ever seen of them. They were being crazy. And I loved every second of it. Southern charm adjacent, but she's. <laughs> would you like one? <laughs> give me, we give me some time. Bar. Yeah, hard <laughs> Yeah. Anything to loosen you up. Yeah. <laughs> but how I posted it on Thanksgiving so that she can. So this design test thing is taking forever. It is December 3rd now and I still have not finished it. And I can't figure out how to do anything. And it's just bad. It's going poorly, I guess. I thought it was going well, but it's going bad. So I'm just still doing this. And it's two and I've been working on it since like 10. Oh my god. Okay, so I've just finished. It's like... 5.23. And I'm completely burnt to the crisp and so I'm just gonna rest for a little bit and then hopefully I'll edit this together oh, wait when I try to show you what I've got with me here but who's to say okay hello it's December 4th and I am actually getting ready to go and pick up a little like makeup vanity for this area right next to my bathroom. Here. Right now I have like a bunch of bathroom stuff stored not so cutely right there. Um, and like I'm a big bathroom products girl and my bathroom's tiny. Let's see if you can... Like, there's not much going on. It's really tiny. Like, the door opens all the way, you 
and like that's his fake lips like as wide as the room is um so hopefully we'll save like a little space uh, with bathroom stuff with that and then I'll also use it as like a makeup vanity also um but yeah so that's exciting found it on Facebook for $40 I really wanted one with like a circular mirror but I was like tired of waiting and I was able to borrow a truck so yeah hopefully it goes as planned I measured it and it's like looking like it's gonna be like a tight squeeze it's 49 inches wide but the lady on Facebook seems like kind of weird I don't know if she's correct in that, but we will see. Either way it fits where I want it to fit, even if it's 33 wide or 49, because I measured, but yeah, we will see. I finished my design test last night and sent it in. So I'm free of that burden. Today I'm gonna try to, after this whole thing goes down, I'm gonna try to figure out my, like I just applied for like healthcare. So I need to figure that out and I need to get like a new primary care doctor. But yeah, so I think I'm just gonna combine the first days of Vlogmas because I haven't been filming. But I've been busy. But I'm gonna try to be better now. Okay. Um, my neck. My neck really hurts. Like, really badly. I need to work out. Honestly, I would love to work out today, but... I don't know if that's gonna happen. So this area is the area the vanity will be going. Yes, my window is covered in plastic. No, I don't know when it's going to get fixed. You need all this beer on. You're helping me with the I can make you lunch. No, it's going more towards. Not by the window. Here she is. She's beautiful and gorgeous. Um, but the mirror, I mean, it's really dirty, so I need to clean it. And the mirror is like tipping forward, so I need to find some stuff that will prevent it from doing that. Okay, so disregard my vibe. So it's been 
hours. It took me two hours to clean the vanity. Uh, it was really gross. But basically I thought my whole house would be clean by now. And it simply is not. And I got some Amazon packages and I think one of them is the like new curtain rods and curtains I ordered. And so I think that if it is, I'm going to do that since my tools are all out anyway. But I thought I'd check it out. Live. Oh, nope, see, this is dog food. Cool. under cabinet lighting. So maybe I'll do that right now, but I don't really want to do that right now. And then a doormat. Cool, so not what I thought it was. Which means I just have to keep cleaning, which I don't want to do, which I might give up on now. Okay, well, I'm not going to clean anymore and I think I'm just going to spend the rest of the night editing the vlogmas. Sorry that I'm like five days late, but I'm going to try to do a video a day from here out. I've just been obviously kind of busy. Oh my god. And he's happy because I just asked him to quails. Um, but yeah. Thanks for watching. Um, I'll see you hopefully tomorrow. And hopefully I can finally get my insurance stuff figured out and finish all the stuff I need to finish. Go ahead. Oh my god, it's snowing. Cleaning my uh, vanity took off three of my nails. Painted them like three days ago. You too. It's like 1 a.m. Like yeah, looking totally. at the road. Yeah. Totally 1 a.m. vibes. Becca's making me drop her back off at her house. <laughs> <laughs> she came for next to no reason, literally, <laughs> just to pop into the car, reek it up of rosemary, <laughs> and then, like, literally, I picked her up got Taco Bell and now I'm <laughs> dropping her back off and she didn't even get any Taco Bell. I was bored. So you needed like a little joy ride? Yeah. For like three Pretty minutes. Much. It doesn't make any sense. You should have picked me up. Why? You were driving. Yeah, well your house is on a one way like going the opposite direction. 